The performance of aerospace is fundamentally determined by electronics, hardware components and software. The DLR work therefore is concentrating and has a strong emphasis on the requirements of the IT infrastructure. The previous system was no longer able to meet the demanding requirements on stability and availability. The existing solution was based on a hierarchical storage management approach. That approach was after a short time of productive work uh, unstable and showed to be uh, not appropriate for a fail-safe environment. We therefore needed to adapt our infrastructure and applications to accommodate a new storage system which was able to meet the requirements of aerospace uh, in terms of availability and 24 by 7 support. We therefore needed a new solution for the storage system which accommodates the existing applications and infrastructure and to provide a fail-safe operation 24 by 7 each day of the year. Importantly, the funding for this new storage system had to come from ESA, the European Space Agency. So we had to make a compelling case to convince them to invest in a new storage system. That was a hard and difficult task for us. Um, the project by itself was a very long process, uh, an, an unusual long process because we had discussions over two years to find out the best solutions together with the customer. Um, we had changing uh, requirements during that time, we had uh, changing budget issues during that time. One of the biggest issues during the project was that uh, because of the space uh, character of the project, we had to cover uh, um, documentation requirements which uh, are much longer, um, much more in detail than it's normal in a commercial account. This was one of the aspects we had to cover during the implementation of the project and in the process of uh, defining the steps for the project by itself. Together with our partner Hitachi Data Systems, we build up a solution, a proven solution, which uh, fits up to the special requirements of the space business. One of these requirements is that the equipment must be a very long time in the data center and changes to the equipment is uh, highly complicated. So we had to cover all the aspects of uh, future-based proven solution uh, which we had to build together.